friends, welcome, it's Rachel here, and today I'm making a scrapbook layout for Scrapbook Nerd, and I'm using the Simple Stories Heart Eyes Collection. This collection is so few, so cute, so fun, and colorful, and um, this is a Valentine's collection technically, but I really don't think you have to use Valentine's collections for only Valentine's Day. Um, I use them year-round, and um, I think this is no exception. Um, I am. I have made a lot of projects with this collection already, so I have gone through quite a bit of it, and I actually finished up using all of the ephemera in this collection, which was very exciting. Uh, if you know me, if you watch my videos, you know that I love to use stuff up. It makes me feel so good, and also it makes room for the new things. So I am so happy to use things up and do those stash busting things and get rid of these things from my stash. It makes me happy um, because it means I can make room to uh, buy some new stuff. <laughs> um, so I'm just taking some of these scrap papers and making some layers um, behind my photo and also using the ephemera and you can see I distress the edges a little bit and have this doily from my stash as well to uh, put layers behind this photo. This is a photo of Remy and I, just, you know, cutesy photo. Um, on my Instagram, I am doing this like 30 days of scrapbooking challenge where I'm scrapbooking or doing Project Life for 30 days in a row, not including like my design team stuff and other obligations. This is just like do a one a day for um, a reel and then whatever, else I do, then that's great. But um, yeah, so that's going really well. I'm getting a lot of documenting done. Um, as you can see for this, I did, um, sorry, someone's calling me and it's probably a telemarketer because it's not even from my country. Um, but I used that little TV ephemera to actually do as like a layering piece in the background. I just cut off the antennas and the little stand. And I think that like the little legs, um, and I think, that kind of works. I don't know. I wanted to use it and I just really didn't think that I'd be able to use like a television on anything. Um, and I thought I'd be more likely to use it as a layering piece. So I think um, it all kind of comes together in the end. I'm putting a few of these things up on some foam and um, yeah, this is actually a cut apart. So yeah, back to my challenge. It's going really well and I'm really finding that I'm able to get a lot of projects done. Um, working through a lot of the photos from summer of 2021. So I have, I'm pretty far behind. Um, so this is my way of trying to catch up as much as possible. It's committing to doing one a day for 30 days uh, with the hopes that I will um, start to catch up or at least like a little kickstart to catch up. Um, so yeah, that's what I am doing over there. And then of course, plus my YouTube videos and design team uh, projects and stuff like that. So anyway, my title for this is going to be love and I'm going to use these really cute um, little conversation hearts. Um, and again, it's kind of represents Valentine's Day, but I don't really care. Um, I think it works well for any day. It doesn't bother me. Um, and I love the color pink. And, um, yeah, so, um, anyway, life update. Let's see what's going on in my life. Well, right now in this moment that I'm recording this voiceover, it is snowing. We're supposed to get a snowstorm. Um, I live in Ontario, Canada, and, um, the day I'm recording this is a couple days actually before it goes up. So it'll be pretty current. Um, but yeah, we're supposed to get a snowstorm. It's snowing right now. I don't know how bad it's going to be. They, people are saying schools might be canceled, but who knows? I think the bigger worry is like icy roads, which of course you like people who live in, um, areas where there is, um, snow and ice and stuff like that. You know, that ice is like the bigger issue more than snow, unless you get like six feet of snow, it's not that big of a deal. But once there's ice in the picture, it kind of changes things. So hopefully things will be okay. Um, I do have to drive for work. So that part makes me a little nervous, but, um, my embellishing is done here. I'm going to take some Nouveau drops, um, put them on my page. I did some black sewing around, uh, the page as well. And I'm going to do some pink, um, 
like paint splatters, I use like a mist spray. So I've been on a Nouveau Drops kick lately. Um, I don't know why, just loving that as like an easy way instead of enamel dots. Um, there are enamel dot dots in this collection. I don't know why I didn't use them. I probably just didn't have them on my desk now that I think about it. But um, I love enamel dots too. I love like sprinkly bits like that. So anyway, I'm um, going to do that and that finishes the spread. I will have the links down below for Scrapbook Nerd. You can grab this collection for yourself. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye!